Good morning. My name is Yam Narasimha Rao, lecturer in physics. Today I am discussing what is kinetic energy and the kinetic energy derivation Ke is equal to half m square and examples of kinetic energy. Now, the definition of kinetic energy. Kinetic energy is the energy possessed by the body by virtue of its motion. Kinetic energy is the energy possessed by the body by virtue of its velocity. When bullet is fired due to its motion, due to its velocity, it is having the energy. That energy we are calling as kinetic energy due to the kinetic energy of the bullet. The person is a diet. Flowing water in a river is a having kinetic energy. When the water is in rest position, you go inside the water, you stand, take the selfie, nothing is happening. When Krishna river is flowing, when Godavari river is flowing, when Tungabhadra river is flowing, when Kaveri river is flowing regarding the cyclone, regarding the you know, rainy season, when the river is flowing, that water is having velocity due to the velocity, this water is having kinetic energy. When the water is flowing in a Kaveri river with a high speed, if you stand in the middle of the river, you are also washed out due to the kinetic energy of the water. Running car is having the kinetic energy. When the car is in rest position, you stand beside the car, take selfie, nothing is happened. You stand in front of the car. When the car is in rest position, take a photograph, nothing is happened. When the car is moving with a very high speed on the national highway, you stand in front of the car, with the car is running without brakes, car is hitting you, the person is moved away from the road. The person is moved away from the road. The reason is when the car hits the person, the moving car is having kinetic energy due to the kinetic energy given to the person due to the kinetic energy is moved away. Now, kinetic energy of air runs the windmill. Now, this is the windmill. In the Tirupati, on the Tirumala, top of the seven hills, so many windmills are there. When air is blowing, wind blows. The windmill is rotating. Rotating means the windmill is in motion. It is having velocity. Velocity means it is having kinetic energy. That is converted, we are converting into the electrical energy. Now this is the nail. Now this is the wooden piece. It is the nail, it is the hammer. With the high speed, you are beating the nail. You are beating the nail. The nail is moving inside the wooden piece. The reason is, when you are hitting with the hammer, now the, when you are hitting with the hammer, the hammer is in motion. The hammer is having velocity. Due to the velocity, it is having kinetic energy. The kinetic energy is given to the nail. For that reason, it is going inside the wooden piece. Now, it is the earth. A satellite is revolving around the earth. The sat when the satellite is revolving around the earth, it is having velocity. Due to the velocity, it is having the kinetic energy. Flying bird is having kinetic energy. When the bird is flying, it is moving from one place to another place. The bird is moving. The bird is having velocity. Due to the velocity, bird is having the kinetic energy. Running train is having the kinetic energy. Flying aeroplane is having kinetic energy. Moving bus is having kinetic energy. These are all the examples of the kinetic energy. Now, I will derive an expression for kinetic energy Ke is equal to half mv square. Further, 
you consider a smooth straight road on this road there is a maruti car there is a bench car it is having some mass mass of the car i am taking as m yeah. the mass of the car may be 1000 kg the mass of the car may be 500 kg the mass of the car may be 200 kg in hyderabad all the cars due to the heavy rains they are washed away due to the light weight the mass of the car i am taking is 100 kg only all now these are made of fiber only body now initially the car is in rest position rest position means no movement no movement means no velocity no velocity means initial velocity u is equal to zero initial it is in rest position for that reason initial velocity u is equal to zero initially the car is at the point a on this car i am applying constant force on the body along the motion of the body when the force is applied on the body the body is moving with a certain velocity the velocity of the car is v the force is applied on your body and due to the constant force in the direction of motion the body get into motion the body is having velocity and due to the velocity the car is having kinetic energy due to the external force the body is in motion after some time after 3 seconds after 2 minutes after 5 minutes after 10 seconds the body comes to the another point b initial position of the car is at a after some time the car is at b the car has traveled some distance in the direction of force applied the car has traveled some distance it may be 1 km it may be 2 km it may be 3 km the displacement of the car is s now when force is applied on your body the car has traveled some distance this external force has done some work on this body due to the work by the external force the car is in motion we have to calculate work done by the external force on the car work done by the external force on the car on the car on the car work done formula work done is equals to work done is equals to W is equals to F dot S. F is the constant external force. S represents the displacement of the body. Now we know one formula. F dot S. F dot S means F S cos theta. Now in PUC first year or class eleven. there is a formula in the vectors a dot b is equals to a dot b is equals to mod a mod b cos theta similarly a dot b means ab cos theta f dot s means f s cos theta theta is the angle between the external force and the displacement in this example force is applied along the x axis the body is moving along x axis now force and displacement both are in same direction both are in same direction force is applied along x axis body is moving along x axis both are moving along the same direction both are parallel angle between the parallel lines is zero force is applied along x axis body is moving along x axis both are moving in the same direction 
force and displacement both are in same direction same direction means theta is equal to 0 angle between the force and the displacement is equal to 0 force and displacement are in the same direction these are parallel angle between the parallel lines is 0 theta is equal to 0 theta is the angle between force and displacement now w is equal to f According to the Newton's second law, F is equal to MA. F is equal to MA. A represents the acceleration. F, F means MA. Yes, I am writing yes. Yes represents the displacement. Cos theta. Theta is the angle between force and displacement. Force and displacement both are in same direction. Same direction means theta is equal to zero. Theta means zero degrees. Cos 0 degrees is equal to 1. W is equal to M. Mass of the body. A. Acceleration. S. Cos 0. Cos 0 means 1. W is equal to M. A. S. Now please listen here. A represents acceleration. Initially the body is in rest. When the, when the external force is applied, the body is in motion. There is a change in velocity. Whenever there is a change in velocity, the body is having acceleration. The definition of the acceleration is rate of change of velocity. Initially it is in rest. After external force is applied, the body is in motion. There is a change in velocity. Due to the change in velocity, this car is having acceleration we have to find that acceleration now this is the equation number one now please listen here initially the body is in rest initial velocity is equal to zero initial velocity u is equal to zero the body is in the rest position when external force is applied, the body is in motion. Motion is the body is having velocity. It is the final velocity. Final. Final velocity. V is equal to final velocity is representing with V. Now please listen here. Initially it is at A. When the force is applied, after some time the body is at B. It has traveled some distance. The distance traveled is yes or displacement 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 is s it has traveled some distance that we are in straight line distance we are calling as displacement is s now acceleration acceleration a acceleration is a v u a S, we have to calculate this acceleration. We are having one formula. We, we are having one formula. V square minus U square is equal to 2AS. V square minus U square is equal to 2AS. V, V means V only. V square, V square. U, U, U is equal to 0. Initially it is in rest. U means 0. Square square. 2AS. V square is equal to, no value for 0, no value for 0, 2 A S. V square, 2 comes to denominator, S comes to denominator, that is equal to A. This is the expression for acceleration. Now, substitute this A value in this equation. Substitute substitute second equation in first equation what is the first equation what is the first equation w is equals to m a s it is the first equation w is equals to m a a means what v square by 2 s a means acceleration a is equal to v square by 2 s a means v square by 2 s into s yes yes gets cancelled w is equal to here no one is there i am writing one here no one is there i am writing one by 2 m v square now initially it is in rest position when force is applied the body is in motion 
the uh, this external force is doing some work on this body and due to that work the body is in motion motion means the body is having velocity and due to the velocity body is having kinetic energy work done is utilized for kinetic energy work done is utilized for kinetic energy work done is utilized for the kinetic energy now kinetic energy is equals to work done Kinetic energy is equal to work done. Work done is half mv square. Half mv square. This is the expression for kinetic energy. Thank you.